Japan is one of the best known countries for hot springs. In Japan alone, there are more than 2,700 hot spring sources and around 3,000 accommodations for them. Today, I'm gonna introduce two one of a kind hot spring resorts in the very south of Japan Yufuin and Beppu. Hey guys, it's Wes. As some of you already know, I'm traveling around Europe now. But I thought it might be fun to look back on some of my old footage. So today, I'm gonna share my trip to Yufuin and Beppu from this summer when I was still living in Japan. Maybe many of you have never heard of Yufuin and Beppu because they are far away from other major tourist spots. But there are a lot of union cut springs that you can only experience here, such as sand baths and Jikoku Hail Hot Springs. Are you ready to explore? Let's get started! Yufuin and Beppu are both located in Oita Prefecture, which is known as Hot Spring Prefecture among Japanese people. Oita is located in the Kyushu region, which is the southernmost of the four major Japanese islands. Last summer, I was traveling around Kyushu and decided to stop by these two hot spring resorts that are very popular in Japan. First, I made my way to Yufuin. Yufuin is a small town on a flat river basin surrounded by mountains. There is a nice tourist train there, and you can see Japan's nature and local life on the way. I arrived in Yufuin in the evening, but I guess it was too late because I didn't see anyone there. The shops are all closed because it's already evening. So, yeah, I'm gonna come back here tomorrow and maybe eat some pudding because it seems like it's popular here. When I came back to the main street the next day, the shops were open and there were other tourists around. Yufuin is not a big city, but it's popular as a hot spring resort that has a lot of Japanese traditional houses and rich nature, so it feels like going back in time. Before the pandemic, these streets were filled with both domestic and foreign tourists, especially people from East Asia. Some shops have pictures of celebrities who came here privately. Beyonce came to this shop. I didn't expect to see Beyonce in this small rural town. Over tourism actually used to be a big problem here, but since the pandemic started, Yufui has regained its Japanese small town feeling. In the middle of Yufui, there is a pretty western style village that looks like it just came out of a fairy tale. This small area is called Yufui Flora Village and it's modeled after the Cotswolds in England. There are a lot of Ghibli and other character shops. But the highlight of this area is the Owl Garden, where you can spend time with a lot of owls. I'm a little nervous because everyone's staring at me. <laughs> Yufuin is well known for its hot springs, and there are some walking public baths when you walk around the town. Meanwhile, this one is only for local people, so tourists are not allowed to enter. I didn't know this kind of hot spring exists, but I thought it was a good idea to reserve a special place for locals to relax, because most hot springs are full with tourists. Most dokan in Japan's hot spring resorts like Yufuin have their own bathing facility with the water from the hot spring. This bath is in the hotel that I stayed in. As I mentioned yesterday, I did have a pudding, which is a specialty here, before moving to my next destination, Beppu. 
Beppu is one of the most famous hot spring resorts in Japan. Beppu boasts the largest number of hot springs in Japan, and the volume of thermal spring water discharged is the largest in the country. There are as many as eight major hot spring areas, giving rise to the name Beppu Hatto. What's unique about Beppu, besides its abundance of thermal waters, is the wide range of bath types. One of the things you have to do in Beppu is take the hell tour, Jigoku Meguri. There are seven hot springs called hells, with each offering a different experience. The first one is Wumi Jigoku, Sea Hell, which features a pond of boiling cobalt blue water. This is Wumi Jigoku. Look at this team. It's not actually very hot from here, but I'm sure you can get in the water. The nearby restaurant has a pudding steamed in this hot spring, so yeah, I'm gonna eat it. It feels like I keep eating pudding in this trip. The next hell is Onishi Bozu Jikoku. Bozu means shaved head and it's called that because the appearance of boiling grey hot mud resembles one. Please forgive me for having only a couple of pictures and videos of this hell because I was still busy eating the pudding at this time. This one is called Kamada Jikoku, Cooking Stove Hell. As you probably already noticed, these hell hot springs are not for people to get in, but just to enjoy watching. Other hells you can see on this tour are Oniyama Jikoku, Demon Mountain Hell, which is also known as Crocodile Hell, Shiraike Jikoku, White Pond Hell, which has milky looking water, and Chinoike Jikoku, Blood Pond Hell, which is called that for very obvious reason. Finally, the hell tour is finished with Tatsumaki Jikoku, Water Spout Hell, featuring a geyser that erupts every 30 minutes. Now that the tour is finished, it's time to explore Bep City. When you walk around the city, you can see how hot spring culture is closely connected with local life. This is just a normal department store near my hotel, and there is a foot bath in front of the entrance. This is Takegawa Hot Spring, which is one of the most famous hot springs in Beppu. In this historical building, you can experience a very unique bath, a sand bath. I was not allowed to record a video there, but I could take some pictures, so I'm gonna show them. In a sand bath, you are buried in naturally heated sand like this. The sand is hotter than it looks, so it will heat you up immediately once you are covered by it. Your body is compressed by the weight of the sand, and you can feel the pulsation of your whole body. This was a very new experience for me. After about 15 minutes, you rinse all the sand off your body and go in a normal bath, which could not feel more refreshing. The last place I want to introduce in Beppu is Myoban. Myoban Hot Springs is one of the 8 hot springs in Beppu and is known as the only place to produce Yunohana in the world. Yunohana is crystallized hot spring minerals and only collected here in Myoban Hot Spring. It's used as bath salts and it has been loved for a few hundred years. So this is where they make Yunohana. It's actually pretty hot here. I'm sweating. In Myoban, you can also enjoy a view of a lot of hot spring steam coming out of the ground, which represents one of the biggest hot spring towns. I'm gonna end this video here. I hope you enjoyed my little tour of Beppu and Yuhuin. See you soon.